OK, so if like me, you've installed VMware and you're trying to install the VMware tools and you see that install VMware tools is greyed out, how do you fix it? Well, stick around. I'm going to show you. Don't forget to like this video, share it and subscribe to my channel. Doing these three things help us make more great videos for you. So as I say, I've installed my operating system in VMware, but I'm trying to install the VMware tools. If I click on VM up there in the top left hand corner, I go down, I've noticed install VMware tools is greyed out. I can't click on it. There's no way I can install the VMware tools to support the operating system that I'm using in VMware to do special things like I can drag and drop files. You can get uh, graphics and sound and USB drivers in there, everything to make it work as a fully functional computer. Now, it's not available to me here. So how do I make that available? Well, what we're going to need to do is we're going to need to close down our operating system, our guest operating system. So let's just close that down. This one is Windows 7. Once it's closed down, click on Edit Virtual Machine Settings. That's a left click. Then go into Floppy just there, left click, and uncheck Connect at Power On. Then click on OK and then fire up the machine again. Let it boot up. Once it's booted up, then go up to the VM tab just up there. And if like mine, it's still showing grayed out, then what we're gonna go is we're gonna go a step further. So let's just shut down the system again, just as we normally would do. Wait for it to shut down. And then we need to go back into edit virtual machine settings, go to floppy, and actually completely remove the floppy disk. Let's just click on remove just down there and that's totally gone. Then click on OK and then we want to power on this virtual machine. So click on that. Wait for the machine again to fire up and then once it's booted into the system, then again we can click on VM and as you can see there, install VMware tools is now available. And if I click on that and then click on any yellow folder and click on computer or this PC and you will see there, there you go, VMware tools. Let's just double click on that, click yes. And there we go. It's now installing the VMware tools. Then I can just left click next, left click next again and left click install and it will now install. Once it's finished installing, left click finish, and then you must restart the computer. So left click, restart, let it restart. And then once it's restarted, you should see in the bottom right hand corner of the screen, you might have to click on the little arrow pointing upwards, but you should see, there you go, VMware. And it says VMware Tools has modified the user interface size settings. You must log off to apply these changes, close all applications and press OK to log off now. So let's just press OK, let it log off and uh, we'll log back on again by clicking on our username, putting in our password if it needs it. And there we go. It's now fully installed VMware Tools. I hope you liked this video and if you did, consider hitting that thanks button and making a donation to this channel. Or if you can't do that, then have a look in the description down below. We've got some great links down there for you to various things, including my Amazon shop, which contains all the things I love at the moment on Amazon, Fire TV sticks, Fire TV cubes and VPNs. Buying, subscribing and donating really does help Help support this channel. It helps me to be able to dedicate more time to spend researching to bring you these great videos. And whilst you're at my YouTube channel, why not stick around? I've got thousands of other videos for you right here, right now, covering all sorts of subjects. Hopefully whilst you're here, you're going to find something to educate you, entertain you, amuse you, and maybe 
even save you some time and money. And if you do see any videos that you think your friends, your family or your work colleagues might like to see, then please don't forget to share these videos on your social media timelines. You can check me out on X. I'm at CWTEK. You can also check out my website. It's CWTEK.co.uk. Thanks for watching and speak to you again soon.